So problem 40 is asking us to find the standard form for the equation of the circle that has n points of a diameter at 4, 3, and 0, 1. So count over 4 and go up 3. So we put the end of 1 diameter there, and then we have 0, 1. So if we, if we remember the, equa the distance formula and the midpoint formula, we get the midpoint formula, we can... Uh, come up with a midpoint of these two points here, and that midpoint of the diameter would be the center of the circle. And then we could also use the distance formula to figure out how far it is, and then we can cut that diameter in half and come up with the radius of the circle. So we could do that. Uh, I'm going to show you a different way first, a way that instead of, like, what do, what do you do if you don't remember the distance formula or the midpoint formula? Well, knowing that this that these two points are at the ends of a diameter, we know that the diameter being a straight line, if we can figure out maybe the, uh, maybe the center of the circle has coordinates that are integers, meaning if we go, if we look here, we can go up two and over one, two, three, four. So if we go up two and over four, the slope of the line is up two and over four, which is one half. So if the slope of the line is one half, then we can go up one and over two to get another point on the line. Well, if you look at this, what this means is if you go up one and over two, and then you go up from that point, if you go up one and over two, you get to the other point on the end of the diameter, which means that that point right there is actually at the center of the circle. So going up one from zero one, if you go up one, now you're at zero two, so you're two units high, and over two means you're two units over. So the coordinates of the center of the circle are two, two. So I didn't have to use the midpoint formula to come up with the center of the circle. I actually just came up with the center of the circle just by observing what we were given. So the center of the circle is at two, two. Well, now we still have to figure out, well, how far is it from the center to one of the points. So, and that'll be the radius. So if you think about what this means here, we, we've got a circle that, this isn't gonna be very good, but that's good enough. I mean, you understand here, we, this is a, the diameter. So the center of the circle here at two, two, we go up one and over two, we have to figure out what, what the radius is. So if we go up one and over two, we can think about finding the length of that radius there as, just a little, this little right triangle right there, and we can use the Pythagorean theorem. We know that one squared plus two squared is equal to the radius squared, and one squared is one, two squared is four, so one plus four is five. So the radius squared is five, and actually we can leave it like that because we know that our equation of our circle, we need to substitute in something for r squared. So we don't even need to find the radius. The radius is radical 5, but the radius squared is 5. So let's just leave it at 5, because if you remember, the equation of a circle that has a center at hk is x minus h squared plus y minus k squared. This is the standard form, is equal to r squared. So we have our h, k, there's our h, and there's our k. They're both 2. And so with everything that we just talked about, the equation of this, this circle is x minus 2 quantity squared plus y minus 2 quantity squared equals r squared. Now again, r squared is 5. So be careful with that. If you did solve for r and you got radical 5, then you would put radical 5 squared and you'd still get 5. Now... If by chance you'd like to see, if maybe you don't recognize this part here, you know you don't you don't count up one and over two, or maybe the numbers don't give you some easy, uh, like easy integers for the center of the circle. So I'll go ahead and and uh, actually I'll do this in the next video. I'll show you how to use the formulas in the next video because this video is already already almost five minutes long.